Howdy y'all. If you're thinking about moving to Forney, Texas, well, in this video, we're gonna hit the streets. I'm gonna walk you through some different neighborhoods at some different price points so you can see what it's like to live here in Forney and maybe what can fit inside of your budget. And if you stick around all the way till the end, I'll even show you the top listing in all of Forney right now so you can kind of see what the ceiling is out here. And I'll even show you some of the main attractions along the way. So if that's what you're looking for, then stay tuned because we're getting into it right now. gentlemen if you're looking for the most thorough deep dive into all things dallas texas well this is the channel that helps you do that so i invite you to subscribe down below make sure you tap the bell for notifications so that you can stay up to date on the current market here in dallas texas we drop new videos every single week my name is jimmy webb jr i'm a local real estate agent born and raised here and we're getting tons of calls and emails every single day from people just like you who are ready to make that move here in Dallas and we absolutely love it. So if you are thinking about buying or selling here in the Dallas area, then you got to reach out, you know, give us a call, shoot us a text, send us an email or jump on our calendar. If you want to jump straight to a Zoom call with us, whatever way is easiest for you, you know, we've got your back when making that smooth move here in Dallas, Texas or in Forney, like I'm here today. So I thought this, you know, locomotive was pretty cool. So I thought I'd start out here, but we're going to take a, a nice little walk over uh, to Main Street over here before we jump into the neighborhoods. And what I want to do is give you a nice little introduction uh, into uh, and some insight into what is okay, what is Forney all about? What are some of the numbers and things like that, right? So uh, location wise, you're going to be about 30 minutes away from downtown Dallas over here and uh, about 45 minutes away from DFW Airport. Right. And so I will tell you, by the way, that uh, going into Dallas from this side of town is, I mean, that's a um, view of the skyline from this side is uh, really incredible. I mean, I think it's the best, uh, the best view coming into Dallas from that side. So now you should see the jackrabbit right behind me here now. So uh, that's that's the, uh, the mascot here in Forney are the, the Forney Jackrabbits out here. So that's what you'll be if you move out here to uh, Forney out here. But uh, the median home price here is 204,000 and 85% of residents own their homes here. And so, uh, you know, definitely a place to, you know, come and set some roots down. That's for sure. You got a, a population of 21,000 right now. so. You know, a little bit of that small town country feel so far and uh, a median age of uh, 31. So it actually skews a little bit younger, right? And so I'm gonna try to uh, cross the street here. Oh yeah, I got this. Oh. oh, with the speed. Okay, all right, so we made it. But um, I'm trying to stay away from the, uh, from the music as well so I don't get uh, a strike on the YouTube, you know how they do that. But um, anyway, so uh, yeah, so the median age was 31. So median household income here is actually 102,000. So, you know, uh, you know, people are doing fairly well for themselves out here in Forney. And so what they'll do is, you know, you'll live out here and it's a little bit slower pace. And then you'll, uh, you know, commute into downtown Dallas is kind of the the idea and the strategy that a, a lot of people have, right? And so uh, the job market, speaking of, is uh, it's, I mean, it's pretty strong and growing as well. Like Amazon uh, just built a, a fulfillment center out here. And so, you know, you've got to, something in your backyard here, but yeah, like I said, a lot of people, uh, you got easy access into downtown Dallas over here. So, uh, you know, you're gonna have um, a lot of opportunities uh, from that standpoint, you know, being that close to Dallas. Um, yeah, you're not gonna, it's a different style of living out here. So I can't wait to show you the different, uh, the different neighborhoods that we're about to go through here today uh, because being this close to Dallas and having the kind of lifestyle out here, it's, uh, you don't really find it, uh, stuff like this that much, but um, uh, you know, yeah, Forney is pretty unique uh, in that sense. But uh, as far as schools go, pretty highly rated across the board, really. You know, I saw a lot of A's, a lot of A minuses, some B's, but uh, yeah, I mean, the schools are generally gonna be 
uh, pretty well done, you know, they have some great teachers and everything. So, uh, you, you know, your kid is gonna have a good education uh, out here in Forney. Uh, but talking about the weather, we gotta mention the weather out here. So, you know, if, um, if you are, uh, if you can't handle the heat, okay, then um, yeah, it might not be for you, but I will say, you know, listen, if you can get through June, July and August, okay, get through a, a couple of months of some heat and maybe a little bit of sweating from the humidity. You know, sweating's good for you anyway, right? So, uh, you know, if you can get through that, my thing is I'd rather put up with two months of, of heat than have a prolonged winter season, okay? I don't wanna be cold and shivering for more than, you know, a few months at a time, right? I'm happy to, you know, get a nice little tan, you know, for a couple of months out of the year and have that be uh, the deal there, right? So uh, again, if you can do that, then I think it'll be just fine. But uh, uh, yeah, as far as uh, tornadoes go, sometimes we get some questions about uh, tornadoes. You know, I've been here my whole life. I've only seen two in my entire life, okay? So uh, we might be able to put an end to that argument right there. There aren't, there aren't tornadoes really uh, out here. Um, so it, what's more common is, is hail, right? So as long as you have good car insurance, then you'll be just fine, okay? So uh, just make sure you have that, or a garage. Just make sure your, your home has a garage. Plenty of those around here, okay? So, uh, but yeah, the, the vibe out here in Forney is yeah, kind of that small town country feel. Uh, you got a lot of new construction that is just booming out here though. So uh, if, you're, if you have a, a flexible timeline and you're into new construction, then that might be a, 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 a great option for you out here in Forney, okay? So, uh, but yeah, with that being said, let me, let's, let's hit the neighborhoods, all right? You guys ready? I'm ready. So uh, yeah, with that being said, um, uh, let's, let's get ready to show you some different styles of living. And uh, yeah, with that being said, let's cruise. All right, welcome to the first neighborhood. So this home that we're gonna feature right here is going for 279,000, three beds, two baths on 1,500 square feet, which is gonna put you at $151 a square foot. Built in 2014 on 0.14 of an acre right here. And uh, you are gonna have the two car garage, as you can see, obviously right there. Uh, and that is one thing, by the way, uh, if you didn't know, you're definitely gonna wanna have your car out here in Dallas, we're very spread out uh, is the entire Metroplex and uh, we're not, the, the public transportation isn't too sophisticated. I mean, it's nothing like New York or Chicago or much less of London or anything like that, right? So uh, my sister actually used to live and work downtown and she would walk to work, but you know, if she wanted to go literally anywhere else, she had to have her car, right? So uh, that's kind of a Dallas transportation uh, in a nutshell right there but um yeah this uh, traditional brick style is uh, going to be pretty popular uh, in here um you know on the inside it is going to have that open floor plan uh it's single story so you're not going to have the vaulted ceilings just yet but uh you've got the recessed lighting in there a nice brick a fireplace in the living room uh but it's all updated and, and definitely move in ready 100 percent okay so uh you've got uh, similar looking house right here but yeah across the street you've got uh, the brick and stone combination right there and uh yeah i mean the the trees in here are you know five six years old so you know not quite getting above your roof or anything um and uh you know helping you out with your electric bill or anything like that just yet uh but they will in the in the coming decades right so um but yeah uh, everybody's taking pretty good care of their lawns in here i mean you do have some some cars on the street in this uh, particular, on this particular street. But um, yeah, I mean, it's pretty quiet though. Uh, you know, you're pretty close to uh, the highway. I mean, as I was coming in, uh, you know, I passed a couple restaurants, grocery store. So you really got access to everything that you absolutely need right here. But uh, let's talk about the schools now. So uh, yeah, everything that I saw was I mean, there was a lot of them ranked as an A minus, you know, a couple B's in there as well. So you're gonna have some really good schools really across the board out here in Forney. And uh, they got some pretty good athletics out here too. The Forney Jackrabbits, you know, they take it to pretty seriously out here. So uh, yeah, by the way, if your kid is especially into either soccer or tennis or martial arts, 
uh, we're pretty pretty well connected in the, in those uh, areas. So uh, or those uh, in those sports. So uh, you know, if you're looking to you know find a good coach or find a team, you know that's uh, in, that's in alignment with you know your goals and what you're trying to accomplish, then uh, yeah, definitely just reach out and uh, we'll we'll help you out and get you in a nice little situation that works for you there. Okay, so. Um, hey, if you found some value from this so far, hey, please tap that like button down below. It would mean the world to us if you did that. Thank you so much. And hey, make sure you're subscribed as well. I'm telling you, you don't want to miss the next video that we drop, okay? So make sure you tap the bell for notifications while you're down there. And uh, yeah, you know, I was born and raised out here. I like sharing some of the insider knowledge that I've picked up over the years. And uh, uh, that's, what, uh, that's what we like to do on this channel. So. Uh, but with that being said, this should give you a pretty good idea of, you know, what you can come to expect in this $300,000 price point right here. But uh, what I'll do now is I'll take you on a, a cruise through the neighborhood so you can see it for yourself without my big mug in the way, right? And uh, um, so I'll do that for every neighborhood that we look at, by the way, and so you can see it, uh, um, you know, after we talk about it. Uh, but yeah, with that being said, let me take you to the next neighborhood and I'll see you there. All right, real quick, welcome to Forney Community Park. So you've got a nice little playground right here. You've got the, the big boy soccer over there. You've got the youth soccer over there. You've got some, uh, you got four baseball diamonds on the other side of those trees right there. And you've got uh, some tennis courts right here. So plenty to do out here. This place is packed on the weekend. So, you know, if your kid is into athletics or, uh, oh, you got some volleyball over there as well, some sand volleyball. You got a couple of courts over there. Oh, and some basketball. So I didn't even see those coming in, but um, yeah, so uh, just wanted to show you that this is here and uh, yeah, you might uh, be spending some time here if you if uh, you end up in Forney. So uh, with that being said, let me take you to the next neighborhood and I'll see you there. All right, welcome to the first neighborhood. So before we even talk about the house, let's address the elephant in the room. So uh, it's Halloween. And so apparently like 13 people died right here. So uh, if you know who uh, I'll be Bach is or uh, Bury Me Deep or No Escape or uh, Izzy Dead, um, you know, RIP to any of these people. Um, you know, such a shame, but uh, <laughs> if, uh, uh, let's get to the home. All right, so this one is going for 445,000. Four beds, two baths with two half baths as well on 3,100 square feet, which is gonna put you at $143 a square foot. You're gonna have the two car garage, as you can see right there, built in 2015, uh, right on a quarter of an acre lot right here. So, you know, we're starting to uh, see a little bit more space right here. You're gonna have that traditional brick style of home. You're really gonna see a lot of that uh, like we did in the last one as well. You can see a little bit of brick and stone combo across the way with the Cowboys flag waving in the front. Shout out to my boys. But um, yeah, I'll walk you down here. Oh, but on the, uh, on the inside of this one that we're featuring, you got that open floor plan, vaulted ceilings. You got the stone fireplace there in the living room. I mean, completely updated. It's, it's 100% move in ready, just ready to go, okay? So uh, yeah, again, you know, more traditional brick, traditional brick. Um, the trees are, you know, what, what I say, 2015, right? So, you know, five, six, six years old. Uh, so again, not, not quite uh, above the roof just yet to help you out uh, on the on the electric bill, but uh, on the AC bill, but uh, you know, they'll get there, they'll get there eventually. So, um, uh, but yeah, de definitely, I mean, these, uh, uh, I mean, very clean street. I mean, if I show you down here, I mean, very clean, you know, all the yards are, are very well taken care of and everything. Um, pretty creative too on the Halloween decorations. 
by the way. Oh my God, a spider. Oh my goodness. So multiple, oh my goodness. <laughs> so, uh, um, but uh, yeah, very, very quiet back here. Um, you are, you're getting pretty close uh, over here. So we're on the north side. We're in the, the Devonshire neighborhood. So there's a lot of new construction going on uh, out here in Forney. So uh, we'll actually touch on that a little bit in the next segment there. But um, uh, yeah, I mean, you're, you're, you're gonna have a lot of new, uh, so that street uh, that's actually right over there, uh, across the street over there is, they just bulldozed all of that land. So, I mean, all of that is about to be put up uh, as well. Yeah, this is one of the fastest growing, you know, counties, uh, you know, out there. So uh, definitely a, a popular spot, that's for sure. But uh, yeah, I mean, again, you're gonna have access to, you know, your grocery stores, some restaurants, some shopping, little things like that, your necessities. And then, you know, if you need anything big, you might go over to uh, Town East Mall or something like that, or go up into Heath if you need to. But uh, um, yeah, hey, I just got to tell you, you know, in this price point right here, this is a pretty popular price point. So homes are moving fairly quickly, right? So just something that you got to keep in mind. Uh, you know, uh, of course, uh, you're going to want to have all, all of your ducks in a row. And that's something that we can help you get organized with if you'd like. Uh, but let's talk about something that maybe isn't so popular, which are the property taxes, right? So I know a lot of people love to complain about how high the property taxes are here in Texas. And yeah, they, they are they are higher than, you know, other states out there. But um, you, you got to remember, uh, well, actually, we did uh, another video that I'll link to in the description below where we broke it all down. OK, we did the math and we asked the question, OK, you know, how does Texas rank uh, against, you know, states like California and, and things like that? You know, is it a, a better uh, situation from a tax standpoint to be in Texas versus some of these other places? And I think you might be surprised, actually, by the conclusion uh, of that video. So I can't give it all away into your, to you right now, but uh, again, I'll link to it down there. There's some other videos that I'll link to in the description that you might find really interesting, by the way. So um, definitely check those out. I mentioned uh, the schools uh, earlier. You know, you'll want to uh, check out the schools video as well, most likely. So, uh, but yeah, here in uh, Forney, the, uh, pr the current property tax rate is right at 2.29%, which is going to be below average, right? So that's going to be an attractive feature out here in Forney. Um, and uh, yeah, I mean, it's, uh, it, so I will say, I'll tell you the range. So the range in Dallas ranges anywhere from, uh, well, Dallas and Fort Worth, I'm, I'm kind of combining the whole Metroplex here, ranges anywhere from 1.8 to 3.4% on the property tax uh, rate right there. So, uh, you know, it's gonna be below average, uh, not quite maybe top 10, but you know, pretty close on the, on the property tax rate there. Uh, so that's gonna be an attractive, uh, feature when you're talking about Forney and you got the big trucks out here in Forney as well. So, um, but yeah, Hey, listen, we love helping our clients get into homes that they feel really, really good about, you know, but uh, we can't help you of course, if you don't reach out, right? So give us a call, shoot us a text, send us an email or jump on our calendar. If you want to jump straight to a zoom call with us, of course, you know, that's our favorite, but whatever is easiest for you, you know, we've got you back. We're making that smooth move out here to Dallas. Okay, so um, yeah, listen. Uh, uh, I feel our team is the best in the world at you know finding you your dream home at the right price. So uh, yeah, we look forward to to working with you there. But yeah, this should give you a pretty good idea of what you can come to expect in this price point right here. And uh, what I'll do now, I'll take you on another cruise through the neighborhood. So you can kind of see see it for yourself there and then i'll meet you at some new construction all right see you there
All right, welcome to the third neighborhood. I wanted to show you some new construction. So this home right here is gonna go for 553,000. Four beds, three and a half baths on 3,500 square feet, which is gonna put you at $157 a square foot, which is, that might be one of the best prices for new construction in all of Dallas. Uh, you're gonna have the two car garage, as you can see right there and uh, sitting on uh, just under a quarter of an acre right here. And uh, yeah, so not only is does new construction exist in Forney, it is actually booming out here. And so, you know, if you have that flexible timeline, uh, then this might be a, a good option for you, right? And so um, here's our, here are the kind of the styles. These are the, some of the finished products right here. You've got that, you know, brick and stone combination you got the three car garage on this one uh, with the, the the white brick and the, and the dark roof i like that style a lot actually and then uh, we've got this one here which might might be more uh, closer to the other one you got that one there with the, the flags waving in the front here so um, yeah so these are the kinds of styles uh, that you'll kind of expect uh, out here uh, in Forney. We're really close to the high school uh, over here, by the way. And um, yeah, the, the, the price range for new construction here in Forney, at least right now, is you can get in as low as 250000 and go all the way up to 675000 if you wanted to. So uh, yeah, just wanted to show you around a little new construction development here real quick. But with that being said, let me take you to the next neighborhood and I'll see you there. All right, welcome to the fourth neighborhood. So this is the only uh, non-new construction home that was in kind of the 600 to $1 million price point right here. And we are kind of on a feeder road right here. So you do you will have some cars coming past every now and then. But uh, yeah, let's talk about it. So this one right here is going for 650,000, five beds, four and a half baths on 3,900 square feet which is going to put you at 167 dollars a square foot uh, you're going to have a three car garage on this side of the home over here and was built in 2002 on a full acre out here so if you can't tell you got a huge front yard and you've got uh, probably uh, the same if not bigger on the back side as well but uh, again you're going to have that traditional brick and stone combination that's really popular uh, out here in Texas. And uh, you're gonna have the stone fireplace in the living room. You got crown molding on both the top and the bottom everywhere. The, the kitchen was updated uh, to that kind of popular dark kitchen of the 2000s, right? Which isn't my personal favorite, but uh, outside of that, uh, the home is definitely move in ready. That's for sure. So um, yeah, I mean, we are kind of on a, uh, you know, this kind of main feeder road here. So I wouldn't necessarily call this um, maybe a neighborhood, but uh, yeah, I mean, it's a little, a unique, um, a unique situation right here. Let's see if actually, if we can go over here and I can kind of show you on the, on the backside. Okay. <laughs> uh, a guy likes to honk, I guess, but uh, yeah. So you can see a little bit of the backside right there as well, but um, yeah, I mean, uh, yeah, you're gonna be really close. We're, we're really close to uh, the high school still over here. Uh, you've got, to, I've, I passed the you know, grocery store, you know, the, the necessities that you really need. You got the Walmart pretty close by out here as well. Uh, but as far as safety goes, uh, so Forney got, to, it was rated only at a B minus, right? And so um, all, all the statistics were really uh, well below uh, the national, averages uh, but uh, you know there there was still uh, some things that uh, you know some some parts of forney are, are certainly better than others is is what i'll say so you know that's why you got to have somebody who knows the area uh, really well like us and you know we can kind of point you in the uh, direction of, of where uh, what kind of situation you really want to be in and we'll help you find that okay so yeah this should give you a pretty good idea of what you can get in this kind of seven hundred thousand dollar price point, you know, this is a, a 2002, right? But there's gonna, again, there's gonna be a lot of new construction out here in Forney, a lot of opportunities like that. So, you know, if that's what you're looking for, then, and, and if, if you have that flexible timeline, 
then uh, that's really uh, a super viable option out here in Forney. So uh, with that being said, it is officially time to head to the top listing in all of Forney. So you don't want to miss that one. So I'll see you there. All right, are you ready for the top listing in all of Forney? Well, here is the gate and I'll actually walk down so you can get a little bit better picture of the home down here. But uh, this one is going to go for 1.9 million, three beds, two and a half baths on 2,800 square feet. And uh, you've got a four car garage in here built in 1995 on 11 acres right here. So yeah, there aren't that many, you know, expensive homes out here in Forney. And you know, if they are expensive, it's gonna be, be because there is some land involved, right? So uh, the house itself it, right here is a, a 90s house and you know, could use some, some upgrading, but uh, certainly move in ready. You've got uh, a two acre lake right here as well. And uh, yeah, you're, you're also, you get the agricultural exemption from your taxes out here uh, in this particular property as well. So yeah, if you're looking for acreage, you know, Forney has plenty of it out here, right? Uh, this being a, a prime example. Oh, I just stepped in an ant pile. I hope I don't, uh, hang on, let me check for ants. Okay, I think we're good. But um, uh, yeah, so let's do a, a little recap on a Forney right here. So again, you know, Kaufman County as a whole is the third fastest growing county in the United States right now uh, and Forney being rated the best city in Kaufman County. Uh, I think because of its, you know, uh, uh, proximity to Dallas right there. And uh, I mean, I'm telling you that drive in to uh, in, into Dallas from this side of town is uh, really beautiful. That, that skyline view that you get right there. And uh, yeah, there's a lot of new construction really, really coming out right now. So if that is kind of in uh, in your mind as a, as a real option, then hey, you might be might look out here in, in Forney and find something uh, that you really like, right? So if you have that timeline uh, flexibility, then uh, certainly a, a great option out here, okay? So uh, if you're doing some comparisons, um, you know, I, I would say I would put Sunnyvale for sure, you know, your neighbor right there uh, into the equation. Um, you, there's some similarity to Argyle, which is, uh, kind of just south of Denton out there. Uh, you know, Mesquite, which is gonna be, uh, you know, so it goes Mesquite, then Sunnyvale, and then Forney over here. And so, you know, uh, you've got some similarities there as well. And then Rockwall, you know, to the north of you, uh, right here on Lake Ray Hubbard to the north of you up there, I'd, I'd uh, you know, put that in the mix as well for sure. So, um, but yeah, summarizing as we always do, we'll hit the three, three words. So first one is, I mean, it's developing, right? So Forney uh, really has some, uh, uh, some, some. Uh, they really have some goals to really become something bigger than what it is right now. And so you can see that obviously with the, the growth in, in the homes and everything like that out here. Uh, but currently, you know, it's it's still that small town country feel. So we'll, we'll see how that uh, maybe evolves over the next decade or so. Um, you know, I think uh, they'd love to keep it kind of like that, but you know, we'll see, time will tell on that. Uh, but it's definitely family friendly. I mean, these uh, developments that they're building are, are master planned communities and you know, they've got that uh, with families certainly in mind, right? So, uh, hey, if Forney is where you wanna be, then you gotta reach out, you know, give us a call, shoot us a text, send us an email or jump on our calendar if you wanna jump straight to a Zoom call with us, all in the description down below. And uh, you know, hey, if you found some value from this, please tap that like button down below. It would mean the world to us if you did that. Thank you so, so much. Make sure you're subscribed as well. I'm telling you, you don't wanna miss that next video that we drop. So uh, make sure you hit the, or the uh, uh, notification bell right there as well. And uh, hey, I wanna invite you, if you are continuing your research here, you know, hey, click on that Dallas, Texas living name down below and that'll take you to our main channel page where you can use the search bar on that page to look up whatever it is that you're looking for, whether it's a, a specific topic about Dallas and Fort Worth or a specific area that you are keen on, uh, that you wanna learn more about. Odds are we've done a video on it. If we haven't, then hey, let me know in the comments 
down below. I respond to everybody down there, by the way. So uh, let me know what's on your mind down in the comments and uh, happy to, uh, you know, I do the, all of this for you guys. So whatever you guys want, uh, we'll, we'll bump up the priority for getting that out to you guys. All right. But uh, yeah, hey, if you don't know where to go from here, then you should see some videos popping up on the end screen right now that, you know, can definitely point you in the right direction. Of course, you know, we do a, a ton of different styles of videos on this channel. So, hey, whichever one is popping out to you, make sure you click on that right now. And until the next video, I'll see you around town.